yeah, uh, <clears throat> yeah, it was unfortunate. You know, it was not enough fun uh, to be sick, sick for uh, you know a little bit like that. And uh, coming back from it, you know, just as you said, you lose a little energy, a little weight. Uh, but uh, in the end, you know, it's I'm I'm 100 now and uh, just excited to play again. Do you worry at all that you know? against Colorado that you might be a little low on energy or do you or if you practiced hard enough you know you're going to be fine I'm, I'm going to be fine uh, there's there's no point to think like that uh, if, if I'm in uh, it doesn't matter uh, what's going on uh, mentally you have to be 100% uh, you can't think that oh there's that or there's this so uh, I, I feel alright I, I feel like I'm ready to play what is it with Colorado? You seem to do pretty well against them I remember last year in Colorado you got, got the win played very well uh, it seems like uh, you have really good games against them. Uh, is, is it just you dialed in against them, or, or can't you really pinpoint it? <laughs> I think it's more uh, as a team. We are we are really ready every time we play them uh, from the start. Uh, we know how good of a team they are, um, so we're ready from the starts, and I, I think that has showed uh, until my starts at least. And uh, uh, yeah, I, I think it's not only me; it's it's the whole team. How stoked are you guys for this trip, given the way it went last year against these teams? Uh, yeah, of course that you know um, makes it more exciting how how good it went last year. But also we I think uh, we have you know had three good games when I was away, uh, really good games, and the guys were excited about that. And uh, we're gonna play against some good teams on the road now, and uh, kind of some big boy hockey. So we're excited about that. How about when you face a team that has guys like McKinnon or Ranson and on the team? Do you? Pay a little more attention to that. Or are you more locked into the way you're going to play than who the opponent is? Um, yeah, it kind of goes what I said already. It's uh, that we have, you know, we we know that we have to be ready as a team. And you know, personally for me too, I know they're coming with a lot of speed. They have a lot of skilled players, and they drive the net. So, um, you know, mentally you try to treat the, every game the same, but. Uh, you have that you know, uh, thought in the back of your head that you have to be ready all the time. Uh, you know, as I said many times, they're a good team, so we'll be ready for that. You've talked about the way this team is playing. What's it been like to see the guys locked in here the last few games? It's great. Um, you know, it's been kind of up, up and down start for us, and, uh, you know, it's been a little bit of a problem to kind of uh, – get some games going like in, in, in a row or good games in a row. So seeing how well we have played the past three games has been, you know, uh, really a big confidence builder, uh, uh, I think, for the guys and for the team. So, uh, you know, it, it was unfortunate and I, you know, I wasn't part of those games, but it, it was great to watch it at home. So uh, we, we hope to continue that. Even though he was only down for two games, it looks like Devin really, you know, improved. He came back and almost looked like a better goalie when he came back. And that has to be nice to see, too, the three games that he played here while you were sick. Yeah, it's unreal. Uh, you know, he's he's a great, great guy, a uh, great goalie. So, you know, just I, I've been through it. Uh, I know what it's like. And it's, it's, uh, it's not always easy to get sent down, but I think he handled that well, even though it was only two games. And. You know, we have we have Seamus down there. He's a really, really good guy and works with the goalies there. And I think that shows on him too. So, uh, you know, uh, it's it's really, really good to see. And, you know, uh, yeah, it's it's been fun to watch. When you had to go through it, don't you feel you handled it well too? I mean, I know you were disappointed, but yet you went down with the idea you can get better and learn a lot of things while you were there. Yeah, it's exactly like that. It's, it's I think it's more... Um, when it gets sent down, I think all of it is how, how you uh, take it. Uh, if, if you take it as a punishment and you, you're sad about it and you feel bad to yourself that, oh, I have to be in the AHL, you're, you're not going to get much out of it. Uh, you, you kind of be, you're going to be miserable and you're going to show up to the rink and just be in, uh, you know, your own thoughts. But if you, if you take it the right way, it's really good for you. And I think that's how I try to handle that. Uh, even when I was in the East Coast, that's how I try to, you know, think about it. And that's how you, get through it, I guess. So, um, you know, it's, I, I think it's more like a mental thing and how you, how you, uh, face it. You was there a short period of time. Just how tough is it to handle the first couple of days? I mean, that seemed to be the key. He was ready to go right away. The first couple of days, was it a mental battle? Just to understand where you were and why they wanted you there? Well, yeah, he, he went to Belleville and I can tell you that's not a New York. So, uh, um, I think he, uh, just, for me too, it's kind of like you, you're in a new environment. Uh, I think it's good because 
you know that when when you go into a new environment that kind of keeps you on your toes uh that uh kind of brings that uh doesn't make you nervous but it kind of gives you that extra edge uh so you know when you're there for a short period of time and the games come quick you don't have too much you know time to think about it and you know he's a really positive guy all, all around so i think uh that showed out uh showed uh, how, how well he played you guys have two different styles can you learn from each other because you play the net totally differently and it works for both of you but can you learn from each other yeah i i think you can learn from everybody it's not only him i think i can learn things from every goal in this league but you know watching him there's a lot i can i can learn and take to my game too and see see how he you know uh does things a little bit differently you know how well he tracks the pucks and how, how well he moves in the net so uh, you know, in the end, you want to have your own style and, you know, your own key points in your game, which you trust. But uh, this, for sure, is something you can learn from the goal in the league.